Hello everybody and welcome to another amazing video from your favorite YouTuber Nitroxygen. Today as you can see I'll be playing a new game, League of Legends. This is something I'm going to show you guys that is very important because it's something that goes to all gameplay. As you can see right now that there is a surrender button. That means that if you click yes to that, since there's already th two votes to it, that means we would have surrendered in the game and that means the game would have been over. But in this case, I hit no, because someone jumped the gun and said that, oh, we're probably going to lose this one, so let's just give up now. So, I know from my how I build my character is that he's very weak from the first um, level from z uh, 1 up to 16. He's weak. But once he is 16, as you can see in this video, he will start just destroying everyone that he comes in contact with. This is actually closer to the end of the game now. As you can notice, the timer up in the corner has changed to, uh, I'd probably say about 10 minutes. But as you can see right here, battling the guys, about to destroy them, kill them out now. And by the end of this game, that will actually win. So. That's a surprise that you always got to remember is not to hit the surrender button when you're playing games like this or games in general. That there's in every game there's a surrender button or rage quit type of the game. Don't do that until you know you've lost. These guys here honorably take it right to the end. In League of Legends, you're supposed to destroy those spawners because if you destroy those spawners, more powerful guys will spawn on your side, which will let you win a lot easier. As you probably can't see, or I'm not sure, but uh, one of the spawners on our side is already destroyed, because they were destroying us, and now we were uh, losing. We were losing back then, but now we're winning. Look, we fight our way up. We destroy the two inhibitors, we go up there and destroy another tower, we're up here destroying the towers at the main center. Let's see if we can destroy them both right this time. But of course we're going to be able to destroy both of them. As you see there's the, the both destroyer and then all of a sudden all of their guys respawn and uh, I, as I'm doing the major damage, run straight into a turret. If I didn't do that I would have just destroyed but here we go everyone as you'll see in the chat that we're talking about there's going to be the final stand here and the other team hasn't quit out yet and hasn't surrendered even though they know that they're going to lose out of this game here as you can see there was an enemy right there he decided to run because he's seen the whole army coming towards us turn around and run tails that's what that guy did The inhibitors are responding soon. That's what means when the um, those things that we destroyed was the inhibitors, which will cause the bigger guys to spawn in. Which, as you can, see, if you look carefully, you'll be able to see them. They're the guy with the big spike balls on the hands. Those are the guys with inhibitors. You'll notice here that uh, we're going to get right at the end of the game. I use my ultimate, destroy one guy, or basically destroy one guy, and we're going to get out here and we're actually going to get an ace at the end of this game, which is a means that we kill all the players of the enemy team. And you'll notice that it's going to be a really fun match and they don't quit out, no surrendering. Really well gameplay right here. There we go, ace. That means we killed all of their team and then we run in and get the victory. Always got to say GG at the end of the game and thank you for watching. Uh, a nice subscribe, like the video, and tell me how you like League of Legends.